What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? Well, I'm a veteran. I served in the United States Navy uh, for four years. My job in the Navy was calibrating nuclear submarines. So now I do art as a hobby and people seem to enjoy it. Did you go to college at all? Yes, um, I've got a lot of college credits. Uh, I am actually hold three masters in auto mechanics and several other certifications. I'm a pilot, scuba diver, a lot of diverse things. I enjoy life. What's one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? That you don't make mistakes, you learn. Um, making mistakes is part of life. And as you make mistakes, as long as you learn from them and don't repeat them, then that's growth. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I am an artist. I make a living as an artist. I'm also the author of this psychological thriller called The Widow by Ivan Jensen, which hit number four on Amazon. Oh. So I'm a writer. So I'm a, this is my day job as an artist, but my writing thing is taking off. Did you go to college for this? Totally self-taught. I started writing poetry. I'm having a book of poems coming out um, right at Thanksgiving, but I started writing poetry as a child, and I started my art. I was considered a prodigy. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? that it's a numbers game. In other words, you have to present yourself to, and your art and your talent to as many people as you can, and those that reject you, forget them. Don't even pursue them. And then the ones that, that want to work with you, you're on. But it's a numbers game. If you could start over, what industry would you get into? Stand-up comedy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I re what happened is I did stand-up comedy, and then my mother said, you can't, I did at 13, I went on stage, and, they, and she said, you can't do it, it's a sick world, you'll fall into cocaine and all that, and I might have, and it would have been fun. <laughs> what do you do for a living? I work for the family court, doing uh, child support custody and parenting time enforcement. And how long have you done that for? 23 years. Did you go to school for this? I did. I have a bachelor's in criminal justice at Ferris State University. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? How empathetic and kind we really have to be to deal with families. Is there any advice that you would give to the next generation? Just probably know that you never know everything. There's always something to learn and that there's so many different people that you can learn from. And then don't take things personal. What industry would you go into if you had to start over? Probably I would be an entrepreneur. Okay. Yes, I would start my own business. Yeah. I would have started a long time ago. Yeah. What business do you think you would start? Probably helping small business succeed. Probably bringing them into uh, you know big retail um, stores. Because um, I love seeing small businesses, at least the things that I'm seeing right now. I love small businesses. Um, just, you know, building, growing, you know, have someone give them an opportunity to take their business into the bigger retail market and the amazing impact that that can make, not only for them, but for the community. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I'm an automotive technician, 40 years, and real estate investor for about four or five. I'm a hairstylist, 32 years, and real estate investor, about four or five. I'm a barber for 11 years. Did you guys go to college? No. Nope. Nope. What's one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Always watch your back. Um, I think don't take work too seriously and work hard, play hard. I always learn not to, it's cliche, but not to judge a book by its cover. I'm always surprised by people that walk through the door. If you could start over, what would you do? Something with the ocean. Fishing, I'd, I'd be commercial fisherman. I, You know what, I've asked myself this question, I would do the same thing that I do now. I love what I do. I think if anything, I would uh, just advance my career and uh, teach what I know. What do you do for a living and how long have you done it for? I own a a business that manufactures labels and, well, geez, 40 years. I'm retired. Yeah, what, what did you used to do? I, did, I owned a computer company oh, okay. for about, uh, oh, about 40 years, and now I'm a grandpa. Did you guys go to college, your businesses? Uh, specifically for my business, um, no, but the, some of the things I learned in college, okay, what accounting. Did you, what did you study? Uh, I studied business and accounting, but I, I think I learned more on the job. Yeah. Uh, which I think most people do. <laughs> yeah, I went to Western Michigan University and uh, majored in business. And then I started a computer company. Okay. Went to work for a large computer company, and then I started my own here in Grand Rapids. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Whether it's your clients or your family members, they, they keep your word. I would say the same thing. Be honest and uh, follow through. Any other advice that you could give for like the next generation? Don't be afraid to say hello to Mary, good person. It's important. <laughs>
Yeah, 60 years. 60 years. And if you could start over today, what industry would you go into? Something to do with the outdoors. I enjoy being outdoors, you know. I always wanted to be a forest ranger. Maybe I'd go back to doing that. <laughs> I'd do the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, same thing. What do you do for a living, and how long have you done it for? I'm a registered nurse, and I've been doing it for about 15 years. Did you go to college for that? Absolutely. My bachelor's in nursing is from Ferris State University. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Uh, keep trying. You can always improve your craft. Just keep trying. I would advise anyone who has an interest in healthcare to go into nursing. And if you were to start over today, what industry would you go into? Absolutely nursing. Okay. Absolutely. What do you do for a living and how long have you done it for? I'm a dentist and I've done it for about 35 years. Did you go to school for this? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, I did. I went to University of Detroit. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Uh, hard work takes you places. If you could start over today, what industry would you go into? Wow, I'd go into the same profession. Uh, I'd still be a dentist. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it? Um, I work for a pro-life nonprofit organization. I'm an anti-abortion activist. And I've been doing that um, full time for two years. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Um, <laughs> it's hard to work for something that most of the world is against you doing um, but you got to stick through it I have very very firm beliefs and driving factors of why I do it so can't give up <laughs> did you go to college yeah I did and what did you study I studied strategic communication and French what do you do for a living and how long have you done it for I am a retired school teacher I did it for three some years and I taught second grade through graduate students in college. Did you go to college? Oh yeah, I have many degrees, <laughs> masters and masters and etc. And what's one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? You got to make <laughs> being with the people everything. That's what it's all about. Any advice you would give to the younger generation on how to be successful? Well, you have to take care of yourself and you have to take care of your relationships. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I'm a residential remodeling contractor and I've been doing it for 35 years. And I raised our five kids and now I watch my five grandkids. Did you guys go to college at all? Barely. Uh, one semester. Not. No. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Pick one thing and try to be the best you can at that one thing. I would say be... Be patient. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I'm a video producer and photographer. I've been doing this for over uh, 10 years. And I'm also a drone pilot based in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Did you go to college? Yeah, I went to Kendall College uh, for motion graphics and uh, more like post-production stuff. What is one lesson you've learned throughout your career? The most important lesson I've learned is to back up your files. And if you were to start over, what field would you start in? I think I would get into the trade industry. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I'm retired. I was a teacher. I have an art minor. And how long were you a teacher for? 18 years. Where did you go to school? I went to Delta College. Then I went to Michigan State University. Then I went to Central Michigan. Took classes from CC here. I've taken classes from Western, then I taught at Grand Valley, Michigan State, and Western Michigan. What's one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Be flexible. Don't be arguable. What do you do for a living, and how long have you done it for? I am retired, but we're in real estate investments. And how long did you do it for? Oh, probably the last 25 years in Florida, though. Did you go to college? Yes. Purdue University. And what did you study? Marketing, business. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Be honest, be fair. If you were to start over, what industry would you go into? Fashion. Yeah. I would have, but I didn't. Why is that? I love it. Okay. I still do. What do you do for a living and how long have you done it for? I'm a union representative, actually. I've done it for 13 years. And what did you do for before that? Um, I worked for the Meyer Company. Did you go to school? Like college? Um, yes. And what did you study? Um, labor management. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Listen more, talk less. Is there any advice that you would give to the next generation? Save early for your future. And if you were to start over, what industry would you go into? I'd probably be a lawyer. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? 
I'm the retail retention attraction specialist for the city of Grand Rapids. The job was created in the beginning of 2020. And did you go to college? I did. And what did you study? Uh, I got my degree in fine arts. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Be up front right from the get-go, and you never have to make up anything. Is there any advice that you would give to the younger generation that wants to be successful in your field? Well, in any in any field, I mean, I help businesses. What I, but I, what I would say is before you do anything, get a business plan, get really smart people to take a look at it, make sure that the business plan is sound before you invest any more money. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I just retired. I was a dentist for 35 years. Did you go to college? Yes, I went to college. What did you study in what school? I went to Loyola University in Chicago and got a BS in biology. What's one lesson that you learned throughout your career? Seize the day, live every day to its fullest, and uh, put in your best effort. If you were to start over, what would you do? Same thing. Had a great career. What do you do for a living and how long have you been doing it for? I actually just became unemployed like two months ago, so trying to figure it out. What did you do before? I made dentures for a living. What is one lesson that you've learned throughout your career so far? Small little gestures. You know, a smile makes people light up. You know, we've had multiple people send us pictures of the final result with the teeth put in the mouth. And seeing a full smile and having their faces light up is like a huge like perk it's a massive benefit did you go to college and if you did where i went to grcc um i was there for two years i uh became a little addicted to alcohol and i bombed out so uh but you know good experiences got me through some stuff what do you do for a living and how long have you done it for uh actually i'm on disability but uh pretty much for a living i do drawing did you go to college at all um, I did spend three years in college, did uh, architectural drawing. What's one lesson that you've learned throughout your career? Pretty much not to give up. If it's something that you believe in, do it regardless of what people say. If you were to start over, what industry would you go into now? I think I'd stay with my art. There's nothing else. It's, it's, it's something that you know I'm happy with. I can do every day.